Hello, and welcome to our video. In today's topic, we'll be discussing the recent news about Warren Buffett's ties to Bill Gates and how it's causing a stir among Berkshire Hathaway investors. But before we dive into the details, please note that this video is for informational purposes only and is not investment advice. Please do your own research and consult a financial advisor before making any investment decisions. With that said, let's discuss details. The National Legal and Policy Center, a conservative advocacy group, is proposing to remove Warren Buffett as chairman of Berkshire Hathaway because of his close ties to Bill Gates. The foundation supported by Gates is known for its philanthropic work in health, education, and gender equity. However, critics argue that the foundation has too much power and no accountability. The proposal stands little chance of passing at the annual shareholder meeting, but it raises concerns about the corporate structure and succession planning of Berkshire Hathaway. At 92 years old, Warren Buffett's successor is becoming increasingly important. The Virginia-based group cites Buffett's long-standing financial support for the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation and its association with Jeffrey Epstein, the disgraced financier and sex trafficker. The group claims that Buffett's views on polarizing issues can potentially alienate customers, investors, or partners with different views. Berkshire Hathaway has faced a similar proxy question from the same organization last year that received support from almost 11% of shareholders, including the largest U.S. pension fund, California Public Employees Retirement System. The proposal last year didn't argue that shareholders should remove Buffett as chair because of his ties to Gates and other political activities. CalPERS and other investors have been pushing corporate America to separate chair and CEO positions, saying that governance structures are weakened when the same person holds both roles. Berkshire Hathaway has noted that Buffett's 31.5% voting interest opposes the push to split his roles. At last year's shareholder meeting, Buffett said that speaking out on issues can anger more people than it pleases and hurt the company. In 2021, Buffett resigned his position as a trustee of the foundation after Bill Gates and Melinda Gates, the only other board members, announced they were divorcing. The proposal by the National Legal and Policy Center serves as a rare public rebuke for Buffett and Berkshire Hathaway. The company has been known for its strong corporate governance practices, and this issue highlights the importance of having independent board members. In conclusion, while the proposal to remove Warren Buffett as chairman of Berkshire Hathaway is unlikely to pass, it raises concerns about corporate governance and succession planning. Investors should keep an eye on the developments in the company and the outcome of the shareholder vote. Thank you for watching our video. If you found it helpful, please give us a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative videos on finance and investing.